we're going to go to lunch today, Chad. Yep. And uh, I figured I'd ask you to drive today because, you know, we had our little wrap-off and you just crushed me at that. Thank you. So I'd even it up a little bit. And you being a morning show guy, you're usually pretty good with pop culture stuff, right? I like to think so. Yeah. yeah. So I figure, you know what? Let's see how well you know your pop culture. All right. I'm in. I've got five questions. One of them's kind of a loaded question at the end. Okay. So I think I'm just going to roll with it here. All right. First question. You remember Chewbacca Mom? I do. One of the biggest videos on Facebook and YouTube, like, yep. ever. Yep. I actually wanted to order one of those masks after I saw it. It's hilarious. I don't think you can beat what she did. She's just got that laugh. But All right. So where did she buy her mask? Target, Toys R Us, Kohl's, or Amazon? Wasn't it Toys R Us? Nope. She was sitting outside of the store when she oh, just bought it. Oh, give me the options again. I thought it was Target, Toys R Us. Toys R Us, Kohl's, or Amazon? So I took away the Amazon because you can't sit outside that place. Right. Was so it Target? It was at Kohl's. Wow. Yep. It was at Kohl's. Wow. Now, next time you watch the video, you can see Kohl's in front. Wow. Of and she talks about it. I, I don't know why I thought it was Toys R Us. I'm like, <laughs> so you're going to probably know this one because you're a big Taylor Swift supporter and the Grammys and all that. What record did Taylor Swift set at the 2016 Grammys? The youngest person ever to win Album of the Year. The first female to win Album of the Year twice, beating Beyonce in five different categories in one night, or youngest female ever to win Album of the Year. Wow, that's a tough one. Oh, man. <laughs> B? You got it. First female to yeah. win Album of the Year twice. Nice yeah. job. That was a, that was probably the toughest of them. Yeah. All right, now you're kind of a political guy, so that's yes. why I threw this one in. I thought it'd be perfect. So, which of the following celebrities did Donald Trump name drop in the first presidential debate? Megyn Kelly, Ann Coulter, Rosie O'Donnell, or Kim Kardashian? Rosie O'Donnell. You got it. Do you remember that? He hates Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> They've had like this war going on for years. And I think she hates him just oh, as much. Oh yeah, it's pretty even. All right, now we all should know this. It's pretty recent in our mind. Um, how old was Prince when he passed? 57, 58, 67, or 69? Boy, give it to me one more time. 57, 58, 67, or 69? Is it A? It's 57. You got it. Yeah. yeah and a lot of people, they remember that right away, but then you don't think about it. It's like the last thing you think about. Well, and I just toured Paisley Park a couple weeks ago. Yeah, so, so I'm sure uh, his, his youth was all over that place. Well, his ashes are all over that place now. <laughs> yeah, they're, that's true. They're, they're yeah. suspended above his kitchen at Paisley Park. So. Wow, that would be a little creepy. There's a trivia question for you. Where are Prince's ashes? Yeah, there and you did go. Did you know his urn is a replica of Paisley Park? Is it really? Yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah. He loved that place. He did. All right, last question. This is kind of loaded because uh, you got uh, you got smoked on this uh, very recently. Where oh. is Lebanon located? <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was in South America, but clearly it is right by Israel and right by Syria and not too far from Iraq. It was just killing me that I thought it was in South America. Trent even gave me a nasty look. He's like, what? It was like I, I turned into Kelly Cords for like a brief second and forgot that Lebanon, of course, was in the Middle East. <laughs> so, yes, it's in Asia. That was a good one. Uh, I knew that would come so back to haunt me. There's five questions with Chad. You did pretty good, man. And perfect timing. We just pulled into lunch. Exactly. We're yeah. going to go eat some.